Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire have been announced earlier this week and there are already people who are speculating what Megas will be announced for this game and possibilities of other new mechanics as well, but mainly focused on the Mega Evolution simply because with a new game comes new things. Why not? Of course there will most likely be a Mega Evolution, right? Probably not. With the way these games work, you have to take into account that if they did release new Megas in Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, those people would not be able to battle with people who are playing with Pokemon X and Y, and we've already discovered all the Mega Evolutions in X and Y. Latios and Latias are the only other Pokemon who haven't been announced with a Mega Evolution yet. But if there are new Mega Evolutions introduced in Omega and Alpha, how will those people be able to battle or communicate with X and Y? Unless perhaps they disable communication between Omega and Alpha and X and Y, but the possibilities of that are pretty damn new. But this brings up a very important question. Is it possible for Nintendo to apply Pokemon patches with Mega Evolutions that can be passed through actually battling other people? A DLC patch for new Megas would not work. There would be one person that has it and one person that doesn't. So how will those two people communicate? They could do something like, whereas somebody who does have Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, if they do battle somebody else who has X and Y, then Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire could patch their games when communicating with them with the new Megas. That idea could work, or they could do something similar to what they did for Kyurem in Black and White version 1 and 2, because in Black and White 2, Kyurem Black and Kyurem White looked like regular Kyurem in Black and White version 1. So if somebody with 1 battled somebody with 2, and somebody in 2 used Black Kyurem, the Kyurem would look like a regular Kyurem to the person using Black and White version 1 but it would have all the stats of the Black Kyurem regardless. So this could be done in a way with these Mega Evolutions that they might potentially introduce in Omega and Alpha. Because if there's a Mega Skeptile in Omega and Alpha, and somebody uses that to battle somebody with X and Y, that Skeptile could possibly just look like a regular Skeptile in X and Y, while even though it does have the Mega stats. So that is definitely a possibility to make this whole thing happen. Considering that everyone is excited about Mega Evolutions, it would be a shame if Nintendo didn't find a way to pull them off. But even though there is a hope, it doesn't change the disturbing reality. Uh, there is a high chance that the only new Mega Evolutions that will be introduced in Omega and Alpha will be Latios and Latias. If that's all they got on the plate for us for this game, then Nintendo didn't really prepare too well. Or should I say Game Freak? But then again, while Canyon and Hoopa, that could possibly be something that's introduced with Omega and Alpha as well. Potentially version exclusives. What will be the case? We'll find out later today when we see the broadcast. Or maybe not. It'll probably take a while.